Chris Carlson's a good friend of mine and an amazing musician, probably the best musician I know personally. And about six months ago, he got married, and I was supposed to go over to L.A. to film his wedding. But unfortunately, as some of my earlier viewers may remember, I tore my bicep six months ago and had to have surgery. Uh, so this happened a week before his wedding, and I had surgery about three or four days before his wedding, so I ended up not going, and I feel really bad about it. Uh, so the other day when I was over at Spark, uh, sparkfun.com, I saw a project that I thought would be a great wedding gift for him, six months late. And what it is, is it's an electronic metronome that I can build myself. So I've got all the parts here. I've got some buttons, uh, capacitors, uh, little uh, LED uh, screens, the project board, and a battery pack with some batteries. So I'm going to throw this together, and while I'm putting it together, let's listen to some of Chris Carlson's music. So there we are, we've got our electronic metronome all built and ready to go, battery packed up, let's turn it on. And we get one beat per second by default, 60, uh, 60 beats per minute. We can adjust that by going up or down. And even though there's only two LED screens here, so we can only do a two digit number, there's little uh, decimal points, I guess you could say, uh, that once I get over 100, the numbers will loop back to one, but it will light up the first light, letting us know that's Let's say we put it to, I'll scroll up here to uh, 110 beats per minute. So there we are, it says 10, but you know it's 110 because of the red dot here. And if I was to continue going up, the uh, second dot will light up, letting us know that we're in 200 range. So once I pass 99 again, just about there, right now it says 01. We're actually at 201 because we have two red dots lit up. 
Uh, there was no programming to do on this. The kit came pre-programmed. It's using the uh, Atmega chip 168, which is the same chip that they use in older Arduinos, basically the same as they use in the new Arduinos, except for with half the memory. Um, so I'm going to send this off to my friend Chris Carlson. I'm going to head off to the uh, postage uh, post office. That's the word I'm looking for. To the post office to mail this to him. I hope he enjoys it. I enjoyed making it. Hope you enjoyed watching me make it. And maybe in the future I'll do a uh, Arduino project that uh, does basically the same thing. So uh, for now, if you want more tutorials like this, visit filmsbychris.com. Got plenty of open source tutorials and videos there. And if you're looking for some good music, visit Chris, Carls uh, Chris Carlson's website. Uh, his MySpace page uh, is on the screen right now, and it's also in the description of this video. I really hope you enjoyed watching this. And Chris, I hope you enjoy this when you get it. Have a great day.